Hey, what's up, guys? It's Brendan here with Ballast Hunt Flipping. I hope everybody's having a great day today. I just woke up from Slumberland, from the Dreamland. Uh, my dreams have been kind of crazy recently, bro. I've been having some detailed dreams. Like, it's almost interesting to go to sleep now, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's almost like I got a whole series of a show happening. Like, I just pick up where I left off. Like, I don't know. I'll be in this crazy building and... There's just a lot established, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll tell you the whole show when it ends. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much been my sleep recently. But, yeah, it's, what, 6.40 p.m.? You know, the sun's about to go down in a few hours, and I just woke up. So, that's my sleep. It's pretty crazy. But, yeah, now I have uh, some McDonald's to attend to after this. So, of course, that'll be that. As you can tell, I'm an extremely healthy individual, you know, I only, uh, I only indulge in the finest of foods, of course, um, yeah, so, a lot of people wanted to know my opinion on the Nautilus V2, and boy, do I have one, um, whoops, Ugh, there you go, person with anxiety, I finally dropped it on the tile for you, um, anyway, I, uh, what was I thinking of? I don't remember now. Oh, yeah. Um, Nautilus V2. Okay. So they changed the... Uh, first of all, they changed the process on the handles. So instead of be blasted, it's um, satin finish. The uh, material is a 7071. They added jimping. And then they put the logo on the inside, which... You know, let me express the elephant in the room. I think, uh, I think Glider did it first, then BB Barfly, and now Squid. So, yeah, just gonna mention that, put that out there. But, uh, yeah, started putting their logos on the inside of the handles or whatever. Um, so my thoughts on the V2 Nautilus are, if something... It, it, it's just like the the my thoughts of the v2 nautilus are the exact same of the mako v3 and v4 stop stop uh stop um what is it called making upgrades that aren't generally necessary and then upping the price um so that's how i feel about the nautilus v2 uh I I do think that the upgrades are helpful, but they're not necessarily necessary, <laughs> if that makes sense. Um, like, for example, when Firefly here, when BB Barfly or Glider makes a change, um, they'll they'll add more to it even even after they've already added, and the price difference won't be ridiculous you know um but yeah so for example like let's see yeah when glider did a v3 to v4 they changed a lot and added bushings and it was only five extra dollars um but you know squid industries added in one like four lines of milling and then they're like all right that's 20 30 extra dollars just for the base model let alone their inked and all of that extra stuff you got to pay for but yeah that's just my thoughts on it um like i said i don't think it'll ever change now but i think squid is definitely turning into apple which i've said before you know um basically it's like it's like higher end material for the same performance that's what Apple, the company, is. And that's kind of how Squid is. It's like, they're like, oh, look, we have the highest uh, material. And the performance never changes. Like, nothing's actually changing. Uh, but, yeah. Anyway. Wow. <laughs> there you go. Two drops. But I guess I'll be seeing you guys. Just want to give you my quick thoughts on the Nautilus. Um, I hope everybody's doing good. Keep flipping. Keep flapping. Keep flip-flopping. Flooping. Keep all of that stuff, and uh, yeah, enjoy your days. See ya.